was that? Did you hear that boom? The house would just vibrated. After we hear this unexplained boom, Aaron leaves us without warning. Dude, Aaron left. Aaron, I can hear him going down the stairs. He's gone. He just went down the stairs. Aaron? Aaron just left. He wouldn't even answer me when I called him. He said that he felt something bite his arm, like teeth bit him. And then I looked, he was gone. You been in there? No, I've never even been in this car in there, bro. It's weird. This is the... You know where this is at, Zach? Huh? This is the other turret. The top of the turret. Did you come in here? Come here, Billy. Dude, Dude. did you come in here? Yes. You stepped in this room? Yes. And stood in the middle of it? That's where the guy told me his name was Winston or Dude, something. I'm like about to tip over. It's, 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 it's not right in here. No, it's not. Is this right over the turret that's in the bedroom down the second yes. floor? It is now that we believe the turret room is another strong portal going through all levels of this house. The turret room is where an Ouija board was uncovered in the 1970s when the house was abandoned. As we check the X cams, Aaron is sitting directly below us, two floors in the turret room. Okay, do you see the recorder on the shelf? It's absolutely silent in here. My friend is back there in the creepy weird room. I put one of your dolls right there in the hallway. Do you see the doll? That doll is for you. Will you play with us? Whoa. Something just moved. Was that in the room with you? Whoa. Ring around the rosy, pocket full of posy. Grabbing the recorder, stopping it, gonna replay it. What is all what is that? that? Listen. Texas? What does it say? Listen. Did it say Texas? Listen. Does that sound like it says Texas? Absolutely. Play Listen. again. Texas? Texas in a man's voice. Hey, who's from Texas? The Whitmores. The Whitmores are from Texas. Oh, oh, the George and James Whitmore came out here with their father, James Sr., from Texas. As I continue with the playback of my first and only EVP session in this room, Billy starts getting really confused as to why we are reviewing this session a second time. Zach, oh. we just listened to this. We're doing this a second time. You realize that? What? We're doing this a second time. What are you, what are you talking we listen, about? We listened through the whole thing. No, we haven't. Yeah. Though. What are you talking about right now? Yeah. What are you talking about? I swear to God, we you already did, we've already done this. We have not already done this. You, you listened to the end, there was nothing, and then you started over. No, I didn't. Were... What are you talking about? I'm tripping out, dude. This is the first time I've listened to this recorder. But we, it's the sec. We're. This is the second time we're doing it. Second time we're doing what? We've already done it. Done what? Listen to the whole tape. No, we have not, Bill. We started over. I'm listening to this for the very first time right now. Ring around the rosy. You never listen to me singing Ring Around the Rosy, Bill. What I did, though. Then am I crazy? Because I've already heard the end of the tape. I keep telling you that. Like, I feel like you're playing a bad joke on me or something. You're just going to, oh, I'm going to just no, listen to it haven't. again. No, I haven't. And you're creeping me the out right now. Everything just got really weird right now. You don't have permission to use my body. You do not have permission to be inside my body, my mind, any of it. I command you to leave right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command you to leave. You don't have power to do that. You're not allowed. What is wrong with you? 
I don't know. I don't All right, well, you're, you're like, okay. tripping me out. Uh, look, I, I just want to leave this room. Just No, don't leave the room. Stay in the room over there, where you were at. I feel like you're hiding from us. I know where you are. I know where you are. Go in this. Okay. Oh, you f me. F it. I have to sit down. As I look down the stairs, I see Aaron, but it does not look like Aaron or feel like Aaron. He is unrecognizable. I didn't know I was standing there. Wait, wait, what? what? You didn't know you were standing there? No. So he came all the way up the stairs, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's getting, it's getting, it's getting, it's getting into our heads. It's getting into our heads. It's getting into our heads. I got the worst energy there, bro. Where is he? Aaron! Aaron was standing at the top of the stairs like this, not doing anything. And you came out and you guys saw each other and it scared the crap out of both of you, right? Did you hear what he just said? He just left crying. He said, I didn't even know I was standing there, which means he walked all the way up these stairs, not knowing, until he got to the very top and then scared you like that. But and he didn't mean to. And no. And he's freaked out because he doesn't, he doesn't remember. So something got inside of him, used his body Absolutely. to come up to us to do something with his body. Yes. Aaron is extremely scared and emotional because he does not remember coming up the stairs. And what's even stranger is that these are very loud stairs and Billy and I never heard him coming up them. And after watching the X cams, we see him standing on the main floor, then on the second floor. And after he disappears from this camera, it is 16 minutes later that I see him sitting in a strange pose on the stairs. I know where you are, go with Okay, oh, yeah. I tell Aaron I don't want him back inside the house. And as we are all having these profound experiences, they still do not feel evil or demonic in nature. They are extreme psychological effects that we believe are coming from active portals inside the mansion and powerful human spirits that are affecting us due to our sensitivities. Billy and I head back up to the second floor turret room to conduct a final Paranormal Puck 2 session. And as Billy asks, where is Joe Walker? He receives this. Where is Joe? Attic. Oh my God! What do you want, Joe? What do you want, Joe? Gateway. Gateway? He wants a gateway? You want a gateway? Maybe he's trapped here. Where's the portal located? Where is the portal? Where's the portal? Hell. <laughs> Where's the portal? And hell. Said hell? Yeah. Where's the portal? Hell. Billy now goes back to the attic bedroom. I wanted to come back in this room because now I feel focused. And am I crazy? I couldn't even get myself together. I don't know what was going on. I was so emotional. And I, like, I feel like you're playing a bad joke on me or something. My mind was messed with. But I'm back in this room. I'm gonna try and use the Paranormal Puck 2. Listen, I'm here by myself. What is in the attic? Evil. Evil. What is in the attic? Evil. Why? Why is there evil in this house? Let's forget about the attic or the basement or anything. Why is there evil in this house? Return. Return. Why is there evil in this house? Attic. Okay, that's enough for me. You gotta see this. Why is there evil in this house? And it says attic again. Attic. You can feel it. It's seriously messed up up here in the attic of this house. Whether brought through a portal or some other gateway okay. to its dark past, it seems clear that there is something powerful. Oh, yeah lurking inside of this mansion.